folks, you're not watching a rerun. This is uh, World 8 Anwar, or otherwise known as Romo Cop, against uh, Marvelous Marco, also uh, World 8. And no, we are not World 8. This is the UC Bi Weeklies. Uh, World 8 folks have a fresh, clean new jersey. This is really cool. I like it. But getting back in the match, uh, ooh. it's going to be another match of, you know, who's getting into disadvantage or who's kind of going up into the air, who's overextending, and then BAM! Well, you know, Snake has, you know, he's not, like, combo heavy, he's more about the big hits. You've got, a uh, Toon Link who, you know, if you overextend yourself, you're just gonna take a, you could take a whirlwind of damage or die at, like, 110 to, like, forward air. Alright. Let's see how Marco gets it back to... Ooh! Yeah, he's gonna take a little bit. Oh, from down and around to the other side of the stage. Looks like, um... Anwar is gonna take the first stock. Uh, F-Tilt wanted to get hit. This is a new combo, kids. Practice it at home. Anwar's really good at just capitalizing off of his advantage. Especially when you're off stage. You're not... You really gotta... You not only have to think, but you gotta mix it up too. And right now, Marco, on his last stock, from a beautiful C4 placement, yeah, he'll just throw everything at you. He'll be like, oh, and pop quiz, did you forget I put the C4 here? Blammo. While well, you're worried about up smash or grenade, for Nikita, he's gonna come back. Oh god, Mark's gotta Mark's gotta find a way to get this stock off as soon as possible. Panic arrow. Oh, the C4's right above him. Remember, folks at home, always keep track of the C4. This is practice before bracket. Looks like he's gonna try and make him panic to go to the platform. He's gonna reset it, put it back again in the same place. Forward tilt. Mark going deep. Oh, and he gets pineapple. He still got two stocks to play with, and Mark at 90%. He needs a miracle from this set. Empty hop. Boomerang. Well, he purposely gets hit by the boomerang, so he just doesn't you know, deal with the sword part. Gonna choke him. Not gonna go for the check chase. Just gonna kind of see what Mark does. Mark gonna throw the bomb. Oh man! Throws the bomb, gets hit by the grenade, gets a grenade, and it's gonna end with an up tilt. Game one, going to Anwar. Vibe check, sir. Are your vibes on? My vibes have been checked. I just, I just got KO'd. I was like. I had him in disadvantage and a snake in disadvantage. Yeah. Then I got footstooled into C4. Ooh. Like I was going for the up air because he was landing on safely, but then I just hit an up air in time and he footstooled me and there was a C4 right below me. Oh no. You hate to see it happen. It was unfortunate. But you know what is fortunate? That we're seeing Anuar versus Marco. Are you sure? I don't, I don't, I don't, know why I don't like... think it's that fortunate to see a World 8 team kill at USC Pi Weeklies. What do you mean? I love seeing World 8 team kills. Okay, fair enough. <laughs> but at the same time, we just got off of uh, Snake Normal Link. Now we're seeing a Snake Toon Link. That's true. I mean... We get a lot of Snake action for Yeah, there's folks. a lot of Snake action today, I've noticed. We've got yeah. a Kai as well, who is Ken and Snake. We've got a Ozo that we just saw, Anwar. Spoke. Well, a few people have uh, Pocket Snakes. Mass Mario apparently has a pocket snake too. Snake's a good character to have in pocket. I mean, I he mean, can do everything. Sort of. I feel like he's a good secondary, but for a pocket, I don't know. Like, pocket means like you don't necessarily like have everything down. It's just if you need a counter pick, I'm gonna. But I mean, if you have there. solid understandings okay. of like neutral True. and like and setup, then like I feel like you don't like not like you should shoot oh, no man. snake, but yeah. Jeez. And good stuff there, actually. Uh, yeah, see, from... that's why you don't necessarily want to have a pocket, because if you don't understand what happens in Snake and Disadvantage, you're just gonna get hit by Link Forward Air off stage. I mean, in that situation, it was just rough. I mean, yeah. he was recover high, you get F, you get fared like happened. Recover low, maybe some 
Maybe he would just kind of chase like he did the- OH NO! Oh my gosh! Okay. Stretcher! <laughs> He's just gonna use that as an assist! <laughs> it's now, a 2v1 right now! Here. It's like a Marvel assist right there! <laughs> just... God. Honestly, I love Town for that reason though. The, playing around with the platforms is so much fun and like so... Like, so it's, many big brain moments. Yeah, there's so many big brain moments when it like switches and you're like, Oh wait, I can just get out of a disadvantage by just... Air dodge into this platform that's about to come up, and then just bam. Yeah, the clutchest moments ever. I mean, it's just like melee and Randall. I mean, you always gotta have the clutch save sometimes. All right, we'll be back after these commercial breaks, folks. <laughs> In other news, they're throwing projectiles across stage. Yeah, we're just gonna run some ads right now. I mean, I for one love projectiles. I mean, okay, now we're back. Okay, I think we're back to originally scheduled programming. Yeah. Platforms are gone. The telephone is over now. You don't have to send in your donations via bits. Yeah. Oh, okay. Okay. beautiful. Mark is coming back. He was like, you know yeah. what? You think you had the read on me? I'm just going to set this up. You're not going to see it. And really, like, what is anyone going to follow up with? I mean, he's going to keep pelting him with grenades. He needs to find these setups off stage where he can pressure. I'm honestly not going to kind of switch too much to this place saw. We're just kind of like, okay, I'm just going to set up my wall and force you to approach. Even though Marco's in the lead, really? he still he knows he's gonna be calm about this. He yeah. Just needs him to just That's step. All... He's gonna need one overextension, one misstep, and Edward knows he's dead. And he's, he's oh, up. but that's no up. overstep. He's going for down air into up smash. Yeah, that that was spicy. But now he's at a uh, down throw up tilt. No, no, he needs he needs nine more. Okay, now he is. Now we're good. Yeah. Now he's gonna stay in the air, or stay on the platform. Uh oh. Grab uh oh. There it is. Goodbye. Yeah. Rip. I mean, and when you're playing against Snake, like, if you can't find, force a way to kill them, like, yeah. if you just play for late, eventually he'll die. Yeah, I mean, it's a, you're running on a timer right here. A hey, uh, pop quiz. Where's the, the seat we're gonna be right now? Oh, there it is. There it is. <laughs> All right. <laughs> okay. 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 I see you. I see you, Anwar. Just play around C4, dude. Yo, pop, pop quiz, though. Pop quiz. Oh, there it is. Yep. He survived the pop quiz. Just barely, though. Oh! Okay. That, was, that killed. Okay. Interesting. JB? JB? JB2, yeah. JB2? Wow. That was good, honestly. Great adaptation from Marco. Yeah, really, I mean, just being able to play that patiently and, like, you know, like we said, it's really a timer when you're playing against Snake because yes. if you get too high of a percent, then yeah, they just fish for the down throw. One of those characters you just have to you have to think about what your playstyle is and think: is this like should I keep doing this style or should I you know mix it up a little bit? Am I gonna get red too much? Am I gonna throw up too many moves and get hit by grenade? Or should I camp this much and let him set up? Good thing for Tealink though, he is not wanting for more projectiles. Yeah. Good. Yeah. One good thing about Tealink is like he has the capability to just kind of be in your face, but also set up his walls. Yeah, like these boomerangs coming out here, keeping him trapped up, keeping uh, Enwar trapped up here. Good He's stuff gonna be stuck Marco. up there for a little bit more. He's gonna wave bounce. Okay. But that's oh, gonna be punished. Okay, that's damage. And he went for it all. He was going yeah, for that. He was right. He was like, if you. Oh, oh, he that. went for it all too. All right, I, I like it. No, no I punches pulled here. I love the use of wall jumps from Marco here to, you know, not die off stage or to try to extend his advantage stage. Okay, okay, uh, good setup. Yeah. No, setting up. Okay, oh, okay, good parry. I feel like Nikita, you can kind of see the C4 a little bit better. So that, that is that'll, true. That'll be but, there's like, also a lot of bright colors here though, so it could be a double-edged sword, and that is first yeah. stock going over to Anuar. Oh, I see it. You see it? Oh, yes, I do see yeah. it. Yeah. It's the only gray thing. Well, yeah. You gotta practice. If you, if you don't have a local snake, just watch the stream and just practice. Hey, practice there's the C4. For there's the C4. C4. There's the C4. Not currently placed, I believe. Okay. Good stuff here from Marco. Trying to, once again, force him. This snake to actually make, um, you know, bad decisions. Like, Wait, sure, he's hitting him with these grenades. Good setups here. Okay, now anywhere actually has advantage. But generally speaking, if you can keep snake as much on those platforms on palace as much as possible, 
make him take damage every time he wants to come back and make more setups. Because I feel like when you're on the platform of Kaos, okay, that was oh wow, fascinating fair spike. Oh good, yeah. But when you're on those platforms of Kaos, it's really hard to actually set up for those grenade setups when you're just constricted to one part of the map. All right, now that it's finally the first stock taken, and you are at a pretty decent advantage in this game, all things considered. Oh yeah. Yeah, he really turned that around. Yeah, considering uh -oh. actually, I feel like Marco was winning a lot of these early. Oh, trades. here we go. Okay, okay. Advantage, damage, damage. Boomerang comp. He's gonna use the boomerang, extend it. I think he was thinking about the bomb to down air combo. Yeah, he was thinking about it, but decided not to. Yeah, because Cipher could have ruined that combo anyways. Okay. There it is. He's gonna get rid of it. Hold up, grenade. Okay. Double parry. He's gonna go to his safety safe space. Nikita, how he's gonna re. Go! Oh. Oh. He's still alive, but yeah, still. He's, he has to take another one directly pointing off stage for him to die at this point. But, like we said, when you're playing against Snake, it's on a timer, and yep. he is getting very he, close to that. His time is percent. running out for this stock. Yeah. He's got to be careful about where. He is 0.4% away. Well, doesn't even need it. Doesn't need it, yeah. <laughs> doesn't need it. Who needs it when you got. Uh, I mean. Snake, I mean, yeah, he can go for up tilts, but you know what? Also kills up bear, you know what also kills bear? Yeah. He even went. Anwar was going for some scary fair spikes, too. That was oh, yeah. intimidating. We saw watch. like two of those already? Yeah. yeah. You you honestly, that's, that's one thing you don't see coming, honestly. You're like, oh, what's he doing off stage? I'm. I can recover, I'm fine, and then he just swoop. Yeah. Uh, frame okay. four dare. Pop quiz. He passed it. He did pass it. Good job. Boomerang. There it is. There it is. There it is. It's right over that blue shard right there. Oh, oh my he god! Right he it. was ready. He was ready for him to just kind of run over C4 and just <laughs> pop. You're dead. With almost 150% rage, Toon Link would have... I don't know if our boy would be okay. <laughs> Who knows? Bear? Look at Bear. Yep. Calls him out. Yep. Okay. Too high. Not too high for Toon Link, apparently. He used his e That was Kalos just thinking him to be like, okay, here's the assist. Jump, jump, fair. And I mean, I think ultimately that's why, I mean, I'm pretty sure Marco had Shade Pick this game, right? Yeah. Yeah, so I think Kalos definitely more benefiting him just because those side platforms can really set up for him to go for crazy things off stage like that. Yeah. But even still, yeah, one good Marco thing not in a good spot here. Oh, yeah. Another good thing with this stage for Marco is being able to wall jump. Just for another choice for recovery, but it looks like that's not gonna happen. He's going a little bit too high. He might get shot down by Nikita. It's a oh, no fly man. zone. That, oh my gosh, he barely passed Here he that comes, quiz. here he comes. <laughs> Bam, Bam, man, that's, that's All right. the game. GG's, Anuar moves on. A World 8 team kill here at USC. Unfortunate for the folks at World 8, but I mean, that's just life. Sometimes, you get wrecked you by Nikita. Sometimes you gotta play Snake and Bracket. Sometimes